Welcome to the new frontier of infidelity. It's a hot discussion because for, for many, technology equals temptation, but can it really lead to cheating? It's titillating, tawdry, inappropriate. But does cyber sex like this qualify as cyber cheating? Technology has opened up whole new avenues for cheating. The motivation is the same, but the pathway is different. I'm deeply sorry. Anthony Weiner, despite his mea culpa, myself, seems to insist there's family. a line he did not cross. To be clear, I have never met any of these women or had physical relationships at any time. I never met any of these women. I was never had any physical relationship whatsoever. It reminds us of someone else who struggled with convenient definitions back in the pre-Facebook era. I did not have sexual relations with that woman, Miss Lewinsky. The new rules, according to experts, physical contact is no longer required for vow breaking. If you're using the sexting to keep a secret from another person, then yes, it is cheating. Indeed, the question of whether sexting can be cheating provokes passion online, heavy on the absolutely and hell yeses. We put the question on our GMA Facebook page and had hundreds of responses in the first hour. Most voted for cheating. Therapists and divorce lawyers say techno straying is booming and has a pull for men like Wiener. High powered men who sexed do it because of power. They want the reassurance that they're desirable, powerful, and sexually attractive. And that's the motivation. The ultimate judge, of course, of this breach is Wiener's wife, Huma Abedin. He says she says they won't split up, but friends say she's devastated.